I'm gonna share with you some interesting facts that I've learned about black magic. In the last few years, you know, I've had everyone from jealous co-workers, whether it was my light or my height for some of them. Exes that still had a lot of unhealed trauma within that decided to send some black magic my way. One of the things that I've learned over the last few years is that sometimes our guides and angels will actually allow black magic to come through if it will help us on our path. For instance, I've had people do love spells on me, you know, four online dating sites open for a year and like no matches. So I was like, okay, hey, what the fuck's going on here, right? But I was shown that this energy was allowed to come in because during that time, you know, I had healing to do as well as it was actually keeping certain individuals away from me to allow me to heal so that should I be stupid enough to start dating again, the right person could come along. I had someone do a beauty spell on me, you know. I broke out, looked like I got bit in the face by a dog. I asked Spirit, I was like, okay, why was this allowed to come through? And I was shown that, you know, you asked to be more secure in your body. Imagine how you're gonna feel when this shit goes away and clears up. And I was like, oh, okay, makes sense. I've had other things recently. I had someone break into my car and that was actually induced by black magic my guides allowed it to happen because there was multiple messages in that situation so sometimes your enemies when they're sending you black magic are actually doing you a favor i know anything that shouldn't be allowed to get through won't and you know sometimes our guides allow our enemies to be our biggest supporters so just some interesting things about black magic that i thought i'd share with you that's all I got. Hit that like and subscribe and we'll see you in the next one.